The penthouse suite's here. Granny, are you forgetting? My mother lives here, and so does your father. It'd be like hell with room service. There's something to be said for room service. Breakfast in bed, lunches in bed, dinners in bed. Well, as nice as that <laughs> sounds, we cannot move into the enemy's territory. Vanessa okay. likes me, and she's going to be thrilled that we're engaged. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. First, she's going to want to choose the china pattern. Then she's going to want to choose the crystal, and then the silver, and then, of course, there's the stationery, and the linen. I can handle Vanessa. Green, that you haven't had to deal with my mother's full strength. I'm about to get my chance. <laughs> Maybe she won't see us. You who? Vanessa? Oh, what a surprise, dear. Oh. Mother! Oh, but Greenlee, don't you look particularly exquisite today? <laughs> Thank you, Vanessa. Mm -hmm. Or do you prefer Mother? <laughs> ah. You eloped. <laughs> We're engaged. <laughs> but don't keep me in suspense. Come on, show me the ring. <laughs> we haven't quite made it to that point yet, Mother. Oh, I don't wait too long, darling. And believe me, what, no matter what they say, bigger is better. <laughs> Thanks for the input, Vanessa. Oh, oh, I hope you're going to let me plan the nuptials. Let me help. Oh, please. The item, the most exquisite wedding planner, Esty. Anyone who's anyone uses her. Vanessa, please. No, and I hope you're thinking New York because, oh, one of the really impressive churches there. <laughs> no, come on. Mother. Oh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> Hello? What's it doing in Spezia? Hold on. The contractor, my marble. This could take a while. <laughs> I don't care if there's a storm. Right? You scammed you. I knew you could do it. Oh, I didn't do it for you. Of course not, darling. You did it for Lemur. That's right. <laughs> oh, Leo, think of the life you're going to live. I mean, love is so much easier when you're not on a budget. <laughs> oh, stop it, please. Darling, I'm just thinking of you. No, you're thinking of how you can tap into Granny's fortune. That's oh, what I'm thinking of. Please, this is such a happy occasion, darling. Honestly, can we not turn this into a crash? Look, discussion? I've already warned you. Granny's money is off limits. I love Granny. And good for you, Dad. I'm not going to live off her money. Oh, in love. And noble, too. I am really very proud. You're sucking up, Mother. And it's oh, not going to work. Can I You're just... not going to get a dime of Greenlee's money, all right? Let me be happy for you for one moment. I don't know. It's a new concept. Oh, tell me. Who else knows the good news? You're the first. I'm honored. But don't be. What do you think uh, Greenlee's father's going to think of this match? Huh? My concern. As of now, he's out of Greenlee's life, and I'm going to make sure it stays that way. Oh. <laughs> I missed you, fiance. I missed you more. I missed you more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> do I get that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, I, I would like to propose a toast to my darling son and his exquisite bride to be. <laughs> and may your life be. Rich beyond measure, with love and happiness. <laughs> Where are we going? We're going on a cruise. You are going back to the dock. Okay, this is just a, take a second. We'll be out of your hair. Leo, you're interrupting. I thought you don't take the fidelity out, Ryan. What gives? Jillian and I are trying to start this romantic cruise business, and Dimitri and Alex agreed to be our guinea pigs. Romantic cruises? Wow, that's that's a phenomenal idea. Isn't that right, Granny? Hmm, definitely. Well, even if there are some minor problems. Such as? Well, if you only take out one couple, you can't cover the cost and still expect to hit a profit. You've got to take out three or four couples to make it worth your while, isn't that right? Well, that's exactly what we're planning on doing, Leo. Well, then you've got another problem. And you have the answer. That's right. You and Jillian alone can't effectively take care of the needs of all those people. You're going to need some help. Which would be... Dupre at your service. Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, come on. We make a great team. Remember when we coerced that wannabe bungee bride into another dream instead of suing us? 
How about the time you made me be your manservant? Ah, what about the time I, uh, got Philomena to set up a computer system? Yeah, and you charged her to work for us? Well, what about the time I, uh, made the IncredibleDreams.com Valentine's Party a huge success? You got us involved with a loan shark and nearly killed us. All right! Fine. Sorry, I messed up a few times. But, come on, I really need a place to stay. And I need the job, and I really, really need the money. You weren't this excited about work when you had a job. What changed? I'm engaged. Mm. And I need to take care of my new fiance, Ryan. Julian. Me? Isn't it fabulous? <laughs> it's, uh, something. All right. How about some champagne? Don't worry, I know where it is. How does she know where my champagne is? Greenlee! What is it, Roy? Uh, it's blood. How did blood get on the floor? Are you okay? You just cut yourself? It doesn't look like it. No, 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 I'm fine. I'm fine, I'm not bleeding, but somebody sure is. You know, I don't understand why there's blood on the floor now. Where's yeah. Dimitri and Alex? They're on deck. Um, remember this afternoon we, we had those cases of champagne delivered? Maybe one of the delivery men cut himself. Cases? Oh. Perfect. Let's open a few more bottles and toast our engagement. Please tell me it's not domestic. No, they're French. That's why they call them champagne. And they're not for you. Leo. Uh, come on, you guys. Look, I know that Greenlee says things sometimes that she probably shouldn't. But that's one of the reasons I love her and I'm going to marry her. <laughs> but hopefully you guys can give her another chance. Your, our friendship means a lot to me and I'd really like to keep it. We're cool, Leo. Yeah, but what I'm asking is if you could be cool with Greenlee, too. We're together now, please. Well, nobody can tell you who to love, so congratulations. Mm -hmm. I hope you two bring out the best in each other. God knows we're in trouble if you don't. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Well, Greenlee, I will never forget how you helped me that night when the car got stranded. Yeah, well, all I did was walk to the payphone and call 911. You saved my life. Twice, actually. I did. We never thanked you for calling the cops when those guys hijacked the yacht. Leo told us. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm good with the phone. This is great. <laughs> we just get in line. Love it. <laughs> and there's, a, there's another upside to you guys sticking around. We have to, you know, get used to dealing with very difficult passengers on our boat cruises so we can practice with Greenlee. <laughs> very uh, funny. Wait, wait a second. Did you just say we? Like, like, as in we? Yeah, welcome back, man. And welcome home. Yeah. All right. All right. <laughs> All right. Well, can we at least toast to that? Yeah, I'll get the champagne. <clears throat> No. <laughs> there they are! Champagne hey. for everybody! Ooh, what are we celebrating? Leo and I are getting married. Oh, gosh. And uh, Leo's return to IncredibleDreams.com. Well, that, that is good news. Congratulations. When's the wedding? Oh, we haven't set a date yet. It just happened. Well, I haven't even picked out a ring, but I can't wait. <laughs> well, if you want to have a big wedding, you better start okay. planning right now. Oh, yeah. I you sure about this one? My grandmother this is Oh, yeah, yeah. Ab Thank absolutely. You. Well, what happened? I, I, you know, I remember you almost... You know, getting together with Laura, I thought you and Greenlee were done. Yeah, well, I still had it really bad for Greenlee. You know, Laura and I both knew it. After your wedding, we went back to the chapel and realized we still love each other. So, you know, if you hadn't if you hadn't let me stay, man, I don't I don't know what would have happened. So, thank you, thank you so much for giving us a second chance, in more ways than one. I had my fair share of those too. Hope it works out. Man.